Oh. All right, YouTube, I'm back. I know it's been a while. I'm sorry. I apologize. Life happened. Um, we're going to make this really quick because there's not much to talk about. It's a... Uh, uh, matter of fact, let me first because we always start with the numbers. My starting weight, December 3rd, 2012, was 258 pounds. I reached my primary goal, well, well sorry, I can't say primary, primary goal was 180. My uh, secondary goal, which was 165 July 2013, um, about, I would say October 2013, I hit the 150s, I believe, and I've been up and down in the 150s about a year now. So, um, although in August, I did gain weight, if my head is missing, we're going to fight. Although in August I did put on some weight um, in my vacation, I'm just really getting back to where I was before. I gained the weight. I was in the 160s. We'll leave it at that. Um, I did get down to 151.2 this morning. Never, ever, 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 ever do I recall. Oh, no, I did see 145 at one time. Actually, it's 144 something. But... Now, I haven't been able to get to that 145 and hold it for more than a week. No, I think it was actually days, actually. But to date, which was my new overall goal, would be 145. Um, I see my plastic surgeon on Saturday. Um, the paperwork on my behalf is done, the paperwork on my doctor's behalf is done. Now we're going to go to the plastic surgeon and get the predetermination paperwork done for uh, my uh, plastic surgery for my upper body and my stomach. And um, that's where I'm at right now. Again, starting weight 258, today's day 151.2, still trying to get to 145. Really, there's nothing outside of that. I just felt like it was time for me to do an update. Oh, yeah, it's 22 months later. Uh, this month makes 22 months. October 3rd actually made 22 months. So I'm a couple of days behind. I know, I'm sorry. I usually do it at least every two months. Um, I know I say I'm a lot. But, um, I mean, it's not nothing new to show you. Same, same thing I've been showing you for the last several months. Um, I am still on track. I stopped playing around with a lot of the chocolate. I'm not saying don't eat any chocolate. But I was on it daily. Now it's here and there. It's not often I uh, do the chocolate. I'm on an almond cluster thing now. <laughs> My new thing is almond cluster. But it is the healthiest snack for me. Um, it is high in calories, so it kind of hurts my calorie intake. But my cap is 12 to 1,500 calories a day. The clusters at 150 a serving, 4.5 servings in the bag. Yeah, that adds up quickly when you're also eating regular food. So, um, again, that's where I'm at. Still looking to get to 145. I'm hoping in December uh, I can come at you. After being two years um, on my weight loss journey, I'm hoping I can come at you and tell you, hey guys, I'm 145. About two months to date to do that. Uh, don't know what else to tell you. There's not much more I can say. I'm here, I'm alive, I'm still on my journey. It doesn't stop, it's forever. I learned that in Georgia. I learned that before I went to Georgia. Um, this is a lifestyle, it's not just a diet. If you think you're going to just get up, lose this weight, and go back to your old ways, you'll get fat again. Don't do it, you're wasting your time. Stick with whatever regimen you set up for yourself. Stick with your workout, stick at it. Stick in with your, your food intake. Don't change anything that got you to where you are today. I promise you, you will go back to that old life and it will just kick you in your ass and you'll be right back here again saying what happened. That's the one thing about us yo-yo dieters because that's what we call ourselves as yo-yo dieters. We get, we get on a diet, we lose weight, we gain weight. Get on a diet, lose weight, we gain weight. Get on a diet, lose weight. This time around, I did not want to be in the yo-yo effect. Although in the 150s, I seem to be there, but at least it's not 20, 30, 40, 50 pounds weight gain then back on a diet. I'm more consistent. Two years later, I'm more consistent with my um, focus, with where I'm going to, I accept it. I accept 
bread is not for me, at least not in large quantities. Um, rice is not for me. Pasta is not for me. Potatoes are not for me. I'll eat these things. I don't get me wrong, but just in moderation. A treat here, a treat there. It's not a daily thing. I stick with my diet for the most part. Tomorrow's lunch is tuna, no bread, no crackers. Um, breakfast is going to be yogurt and cheese. Then it's going to be a flip and um, probably some turkey and some cheese. Um, that's my life. That's every single day I really change my diet. Uh, the middle meal usually changes into salmon or some kind of meat, but no bread. No bread, no rice, no pasta. Okay, guys, with that said, I'm going to let you go. Um, short, quick, and easy. Peace, peace, yo.